our goal, chat, just a reminder, our goal is to make the most balanced teams of all time. Our goal is to make the teams balanced as fuck. And then we, I guess we can decide who wins here. I ain't gonna lie, bruh. You can't separate these niggas, bruh. You can't, you can't separate these niggas, bruh. We're gonna start with them. I feel like you can't separate these niggas either. We're gonna start with the, yeah, yeah. I, f I feel like, I feel like you gotta have this and you gotta have that. So who the fuck, I mean, we'll do Naruto later. <laughs> We'll, we'll, we'll do Naruto later. We'll do Naruto later. Naruto can't be on this team, being said. That's Crush. And we can't underestimate Sakura either. Okay, okay, okay. Tencent with Kakashi. <sighs> Let's see. Okay, so these niggas, we need... I don't want to put Tencent on, because they wouldn't really help Tencent shoot nobody. He not of my... Actually, Eno would go. Okay, fuck. All right, fuck. This is hard. This is actually harder than it fucking. Fuck. All right. Fuck. Oh, Shikamaru Asuma. You, chat spitting. That's that's from chat too. Shikamaru and Asuma have to be together. Not gonna lie. Sakura was supposed to be like a Genjutsu prodigy and it never was a thing. We're putting her with Karunai. Boom. We got those four. We got we got those four already. We got those four already. Okay. Who's next? Who who's with who next? Who's with who next? Where are we? I don't have anything for Choji yet. Okay, so these motherfuckers, so we got. Shino might work with these niggas. Okay, so these... Okay, fuck that. These niggas need... Okay, what's the weakness of every team? This is why we're going to do this. This will probably be the easiest one. This will be, this will be the easiest one. Who? What, this team sucks at close combat. Off rip. So we need a close combat specialist here. Close combat. This Choji, Hinata, Neji... I ain't gonna lie, this team needs Neji. Easy. Easy Neji. Easy Neji. Easy Neji. Now I think about it. That team don't... Because this team needs some range. And Neji would help their close combat a lot. Obviously, Sakura gets strong and shit later, but they need like more attack shit. And Neji got to be Akugan. Boom. Yeah, easy. Easy. They need Neji. They need Neji bad. Let's see. This team ain't got no motherfucking range. I would say 10-10, but... How is she gonna hit somebody with these two motherfuckers just running around and shit? I'm, but she don't make the squad OP as fuck. <laughs> she, I just like, I would say ten ten, but she don't make these niggas OP as fuck. Fuck it, I gotta put Shino there though. That fits. That fits. She don't fits these more, bro. <laughs> but this is a this is a super team. No oh, bullshit. There's a super team, dog. Fuck. Okay. We gonna make this work. We gonna make this work. Ten ten with Kakashi. Actually, you might be spitting. Hmm. So you got guy. So. Where the fuck would I put Eno? I'm not putting... Okay, Eno ain't going here. We had that established. Naruto is my bailout because Naruto's good at everything. Like, Naruto's good at scouting. Naruto's good at sharing chakra, saving niggas, close combat. Naruto's a fucking cheat code, and Sasuke is too. So, Naruto's my, like, okay, this squad is just so dangerously imbalanced they need Naruto. Naruto's the bailout one. I'll say this. Nar what are Naruto's strengths? Chakra and like mass AP. I ain't gonna lie. Nar Naruto Shikamaru would go crazy. I'm gonna save Naruto though. But Naruto Shikamaru would go crazy. Naruto Shikamaru would go crazy. Durability. Ooh! Now that I think about it, 
I might have to put Naruto here and then we'll figure shit out. Because Naruto is chakra and durability and versatility. That nigga Shikamaru don't have a lot of that. <laughs> that nigga Shikamaru don't have, like, everything we just said, this Shikamaru, Shikamaru would love him. Nigga ain't that durable. Nigga ain't that versatile. And then nigga Chakra be grits every five seconds. And Asuma's win style. Yeah, nah, yeah, we, we putting him here. We're putting him here. Yeah, we're putting him here. Kiba. Okay, where does Choji go? The squad's ass with Choji. The squad's better with Choji. Oh, quick. I'll blow my fucking nose. <laughs> Alright. My fucking fault. My fucking fault. <laughs> the sound effect was a troll, by the way. Let's see. Choji. We'll save Choji. We'll save Choji for now. Ah, fuck! Ah, ah, hey, die, bitch! Mm -mm. Mm -mm. No, niggas. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Not my hood. Ah! Did I kill it with fire? I don't know. I don't do, I don't do those. Hell nah. Uh-uh. Nigga had to meet the woo. Bitch ass boy. Bitch. All right. Anyway. My bad. Fuck. Let's see. I'm thinking. I'm try hard in chat. I ain't gonna lie. I, I want to get this right. I feel like you could do this. But then they need healing. So this team needs healing. This team... At, oh, Naruto's a fucking healer. It's either Hinata goes here or here. Hinata doesn't fit with this team at all. And she can fit with this team. It, Hinata's one of these three. Kiba sucks. The problem with Kiba is he's ass. Kiba would be awful with this team. So, yeah. All right. So, a lot of people... Okay, who works with Team C? Hinata doesn't work with Team C. Kiba doesn't work with Team C. Choji... So, it's one of these two. Let's solve this now. Do I go Eno? Do I want to go Tenten or Eno with Team C? Who fits them better? Okay, because they both suck at close combat. But they wouldn't be able to seal anything. So here's my argument for both, right? They both aren't good at close combat. This team, I mean, they have Guy and Lee, so they can protect them. So that evens out. They have range that evens out. The problem is... They, they're, they're like, not, I think it's harder for 10, 10 to hit a target with these niggas than it is for her to mind transfer. I'll go Eno. I'll go Eno. That means 10, 10 is here or here because there's no shot 10, 10 on this team. That's stupid. I'm going to put 10, 10 down here for now. I think this team needs Choji, actually. Kakashi team needs somebody that's going to fucking blow shit up. Like, I'm not saying Sasuke's weak and can't do it. Same thing with Kakashi. But, like, they need a boom, boom, punch man. They don't have a boom, boom, punch man. I feel like Choji would be clutch for that team. Yeah, I, I, feel, I feel like they need brute strength. Like, they, they got, like, a bunch of assassin shit, but they need brute strength. Naruto, brute strength. Um, Sakura, Brute Strength, Rock Link, yeah, Choji here, easy, easy answer, Choji's here, Kiba, Kiba sucks, so I'm gonna put Kiba at the back, Tencent, Hinata might have to go here, and then Tencent might go here, Tencent with, ah, uh -huh, yeah, Tencent should go here, because Asuma uses the blades. If Asuma can teach Tenten how to box, that's gas. If Asuma can teach Tenten how to fucking box with, like, chakra shit like that and help her in any way, shape, or form, that's gas. Hinata would help this team, like, like see. Because obviously they have sight, but, like, but Yakugan has range. Plus, Kakashi might be able to help her develop that even more type shit. The problem is this team sucks. <laughs> This, the problem is, 
Now we've made a clear L team. So how do we fix this? Because the goal is a balance. Now, now the problem is this team sucks. And maybe it's... Is it Karun, Karina? I don't know how you spell her name. I don't know. I'm going to just call it L team. The problem is this team is awful. Well, I, I can't downplay Sakura. Because in part... In Shaputin, this team is actually solid. In part one, this team is shit. Change Choji and Ki... Ooh! Wait, you might be cooking. Wait. This actually ain't that bad. That's better. That's better. Because you get the best healer against the nigga that's doing the brute strength. You got Neji to scout niggas. Karuna's going to help Sakura actually become a... Yeah, that's way better. Huh. Okay, so now the question is, in part one, who wins? Team Corinna, I think that's how you spell her name. That's what I'm calling it today. Team Guy, Team Kakashi, and Team Asuma. Now the question is, in part one, who wins? In part one... Yeah, part one, this is dangerously balanced. Part two, we can have conversations. Part one is dangerously balanced. Part one, the problem with Team Karuna is actually Karuna. I think these getting taking on anybody. Well, actually, no. Part one, Sakura sucks. So at this moment in time, yeah, they at best split with somebody. Team Karuna can't handle them. Yeah, Team Guy beats the shit out of Team Karuna. Team Kakashi and them. Ooh. Oh, team Guy and Team Kakashi scrapping. Team Guy and Kakashi would scrap the hell. I'd say. I'd say I think I got Team Guy winning that. Because it's implied that Guy is a little bit stronger than Kakashi at this point in time. Sasuke would beat Lee. I know a lot of you guys want Lee to win that. Sasuke would beat Lee. But Shino is cooking, niggas. That's two up. So then who would win the follow-up fight? These two damn near cancel out. My problem is, if this was like a four on four, this team burns out before this team does. Because these niggas just go gates and fall at some point, but then she knows here. And that's the... Hmm. Lee might beat Sasuke. No, he wouldn't. Not even a little bit. Uh, <laughs> I, I I get I get it look cool. No, he wouldn't. <laughs> he 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 would not. <laughs> he just that that nigga that that nigga that nigga Sasuke pulls out a wing and we're laughing. Not it's not even remotely close. It's not even it's actually unfunny how bad he would get cooked. But um Shino though. That's, I think Shino is jobbing Kiba. Kiba's irrelevant now. Hinata would beat the piss out of Eno. The question is, could they protect Eno in time while also fighting these two? I'm saying no. So these two niggas are done. So then it would be on some Shino Hinata shit. Yeah, Team Guy would win. Team Guy would win. Team Guy would win. Team Guy would win. Because cause I, I guarantee you now, Shino is taking care of both... She knows she knows taking care of both of these motherfuckers before these fights are over. She yeah, she know yeah, she knows solos them. Yeah, that's that's ball game. Would they beat this team? Naruto's okay. So this is the question. Is is it plug your con is it plug your controller in con is is it controller Naruto or is it just who he is Naruto? Because if you could just like 
plug a controller and play hey i'm naruto this is this is a pick em. cause Naruto just bites his thumb, says summoning jutsu, and now you turn, and now these two are just out of the fight. And no, my bad, these two are just out of the fight. And I'm not saying that Lee can't handle Shino, but I'm saying Lee would try to kick Lee would try to kick the fucking Gamma Bunta and die. So it it literally, <laughs> it, it literally, yeah, that's tough. And then also, if he has any uh KCM cloaks. Naruto's jobbing everybody but this nigga. Let alone Shikamaru. Oh, this is end of part one. This is part one. This is end of part one. We're doing part one. I'm getting the rankings, and then we're going to do Shippuden. Shippuden, I'm going to probably nerf it to you can't kill more than two people. Because obviously then we would just say the team with Sasuke and Naruto wins. So... Damn. Yeah, Team Asuma and Team Guy are scrapping, bro. Because Asuma's implied to, like, he wouldn't have folded. Like, I know it's a brief exchange, but when Kisame and Itachi pulled up, Asuma was holding his own. It was until they were like, yo, you don't look at Itachi, you just lose. Shino eating? Shino running through Team Asuma? Fuck no. Fuck no. He can't do anything against Naruto. Can't. Like, that actually just could. Naruto would just heal up in time and or get a cloak. And y'all said, like, in like plug-in shit. I don't even think the bugs would get through the chakra. So that's, yeah. Not those bugs. Maybe adult bugs, maybe. But, yeah, like, nah. He can't, he, I think Naruto's just a hard counter to Shino. That's fucked up, but true. Now, the problem is Lee is actually jobbing Tenten. Like, it's an actual, Lee and Eno are actual, factual jobbing Tenten. So that's tough. But Naruto wouldn't leave them alone because he can shadow clone. So if Shikamaru could outsmart Lee and get him trapped, this team is cooked. The question is, does it happen? Why can't you type you just did? The question, the, the, this fight is determined by this nigga. High key. The question is, if before Guy takes Asuma down, could Shikamaru trap Lee or two of these niggas? And I know, yeah, if the smartest nigga outsmart one of the dumbest, yeah, yeah, but he's completely outclassed in terms of speed. Completely. Like, y'all would, y'all wouldn't say, y'all, y'all trying to make this shit more linear than it is. Put it this way. Would you say part one Shigamaru would just beat Lee? You wouldn't do that. You'd, you'd get upset if that was a title and thumbnail. So that's what, that's what I'm really saying. Would he be able to pull it off in a team setting is the question. I think as long as Naruto don't leave these niggas high and dry, which has, like, never been his character, I think they could pull it off. But everything's out the window if Guy just cooks Asuma fast enough. Then at that point, they can't do nothing with Guy. Like, even even Naruto, pissed off, familiar with Sengon, can't do nothing with Guy. So, at that point. I think by your hair, Team Asuma wins. But Tenzin sucks. Like, Tenzin is shit. I, guess, I think this is a safer pick. This is the safer pick, but I wouldn't be surprised. This is the safer pick, but I wouldn't be surprised. Ten Ten really just fucking ass at this point in time. Yeah, but I, I'd I'd say it's like this. And then in terms of these two teams, I mean, literally. So there, but this they would win. Shikamaru got this. Shikamaru got this. It, you're basically asking Kakashi and Sasuke to two v four. That's not happening. That that that's not happening. I know we fuck with it. That's not happening. So yeah, I, I'd say I'd say I'd say it's this. I say this would be the order. Now, Shippuden, Shippuden. That's where shit get crazy. Shippuden. That's where shit gets crazy. Cause this team, whew, this team ain't going like cheese. The problem with this team is quite literally Karuna at that point. She's the weakest on the fucking team at that point. Kiba solos Tencent. I don't even know about that. And you just fangs over fangs over and over and over again. But like at the same time, well, I guess, yeah, I guess she hard counters. They wouldn't let that be the fight, though. Shikamaru would try to go against Kiba. And then this would be that. Tencent sucks. Tencent's out. I'm saying essentially Shikamaru would ha- be able to handle this assault, in my opinion. I think Kiba, Kiba literally doing fang over fang would make a shadow, get him packed up. 
And then as long as Naruto don't leave this nigga high and dry, he he can handle that too. Because at this point in time, Hinata is like a willing fighter, but she's not that damn good at it. She's cool. Now, but like back to Shippuden. Shippuden Sakura, I, I know, I know it's going to sound nasty, but Sakura can... <laughs> Sakura can beyond carry this team. Like, like it's ridiculous. This team just doesn't die. <laughs> like, Sakura's team just does not die. So that that's the problem. That, that's the problem with this. Like, like, for example, I think they beat this team unless the team guy says, fuck it, we're going to die. And at that point, it's a draw. Like, like, be, like, let's let's keep it on it. Let's keep it on it. Like, unless Guy and Lee say I'm willing to kill myself, this team wins. Because obviously they kill themselves and it's a fucking draw. Because I'm not gonna say that she can handle eight gay guy. That that'd be od. Obviously in Boruto she probably can, but like right now, like I'm not gonna say she can do that. And then I'm not gonna say, I mean, well, Rock Lee she can probably just take Rock Lee at that point. So it's like I understand it sounds disgusting because her name is Sakura, but dog unless you say guy's gonna kill himself lee i don't someone said he can't even do the eighth gate i'm gonna just say he can unless you say this team kills himself neji is not bad worse enough to not hold his own karunai is <laughs> eno's fucking useless in this fight entirely because karuna would actually genjutsu eno and might make eno clock herself out Shino would be able to do some damage to Choji. That'd be an interesting fight, nonetheless. But, yeah, nah. Six Gate Lee is beating Sakura. Chat? Chat? Now, I'm not casual shaming, you know? We've all watched the show. It's a good show. We all enjoy the show. I'm going to just tell you now. I'm gonna just tell you now. I'm gonna just tell you now that just, that's laughably false. <laughs> that, that it's it's laughable. You would actually get pissed off if they made them fight because you would see Sakura and Lee punch each other, and then Lee's hand breaks. Like Sakura would just like like, like you would actually get mad if you watch that fight. You you would actually be upset. N nah, and in Shippuden, nah, not even just no. Just, just, just no. <laughs> no, he would not. No, he would not. I, I know Lee's cool. He he would not even. It, it it would take Guy to beat Sakura. And like I said, Guy, seven gate probably is a good fight. But I think he would have to go to date because Sakura just out healed a nigga while he's hurt himself. Guy, though, yeah, Guy, guy could take Sakura. Guy could take, Guy 100% could. It's a matter of if you think he gets her in the seventh gate. And then I think that's just, I, I doubt he puts her away. I, th I think this. I think this fight just goes on. I think they just win this nine times out of ten. Because you would argue, you would basically argue, six gate guy is beating her. You just said Lee's beating her. I can't take your opinion. <laughs> I I would literally say at this point, you would have to argue in order for a team guy to realistically win this more times than not. You would have to say that guy doesn't need the eighth gate. And would beat Sakura fast enough to where not only she can't heal herself, but also can't heal her team. While Choji is fucking 8 million feet tall swatting away Shino's flies and Neji does nothing. I think that's too many ifs. I think that's way too many ifs. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to lie. I, th I think to say Neji does nothing. To say that Sakura gets beat that fast and to say Choji's impact is just minuscule enough because I think these two would just cancel each other out. Whenever they whenever they get focused, Karunai's out, and I think Karunai would just like Genjutsu cook Eno, I'm not going to lie. So it, it's literally a three-on-three. Three. I think this would, I think this is how it go. I think that's how it would be. Unless guy says eighth gate, and if you want to go eighth gate wins, then you're right because eighth gate guy would win. But... Yeah, they, they're, they're fucking even. They're fucking even. Sakura is a glass cannon. Sleeping on Shino. I'm not sleeping on Shino. I think I think Choji would be swatting flies, but eventually get poisoned. If anything, I'm telling you now, 
These these four stalemate. The problem is it would take a while for Choji to go down. So it would still be a heavy three on three. And he could probably get Shino out of the way first. So that, that's what I'm saying. And then thank you, someone that actually knows something. Sakura summons Katsuyu and this team is continuously healing. I'm not sleeping on anybody. I'm not, I'm not sleeping on nobody. Seven gate guy could have mobilized. Yeah, y'all just don't know. Y'all just... Y'all just fell in love with Gar versus Lee too much. That that's what I'm seeing. Six six gate nothing is beating Sakura. Let, let's stop. We could start at seven, and then I think that's cap because seventh gate guy and Kisame are, are relative. So to say Kisame would just beat Sakura in the war arc sounds ridiculous. Now that I think about it. So no, actually, actually, yeah, you helped me power scale that to no. Yeah, Team Team Karunai wins unless Guy kills himself. If guy kills himself, sure they can can win at that point. Cause then I ain't gonna lie, it's these three versus these three, and this fight is dumb even all the way through. But no, yeah, now you done fucking ruined it. <laughs> now, now, you actually shouldn't have said that. Cause now that I pieced together, yeah, yeah, seventh gate, seventh gate guy and Kisame are extremely relative, slight edge to guy, of course. If you're gonna, it's in seventh gate guy was dealing with like the them like not Bijou. Well, he was dealing with Bijou, but he was dealing like the fake Jinjuriki type shit. He ain't dealing with full blown 100 healing. So no, hell no. She knows bugs eating at Sakura. And Did you just make like an argument that like this nigga just wipes Naruto? <laughs> it's not. She knows bugs. Uh, she. <laughs> This nigga made this nigga power cliff Shino so hard. All right, let me put this in the screen. Let me put this in the screen. Let me put this. Where is it, bro? Shino's bugs eating at Sakura and Choji's chakra, even with Katsuya. So you just made like one of those arguments where someone has a hack, and you're just like, yeah. So it just happens. It's it's like if Dator just blows himself up. He, he just wipes like that. Like, uh, even, like, all right, look, you disagree with me. If you genuinely think that Lee in the six gate or guy in the six gate beat Sakura, just do your research and you'll be proven wrong. But it's fine to argue that Shino would eat up an entire summoning and Sakura and Neji and Joji's talk. All right. <laughs> All right. Fun fact, Shino does not wipe Naruto with bugs, bro. I'm telling you now. It's never how been the series is implied. It just doesn't happen. It doesn't happen. <laughs> it just it just doesn't happen. Someone says Same Hada. Thank you. Thank you, Tariq. If if Sakura were to fight, if Sakura were to fight Kasame, Sakura would say cha, punch the ground. Kasame would fly in the air. The water's in the air. She would get a clean shot while everybody is airborne and win the fight. Again, y'all. Again, Sakura is a corny character, but she's strong as shit. Y'all gonna have to accept that one day. <laughs> y'all gonna have to accept that one day. Like it, it's not. That's not a fight. That that's not a fight, bro. That, that is not a fight. Would you Would you think? Would you think? Let me let me tell you this for anybody who like next to sick or anything. Let me ask you a serious question. Would you think if it was Kisame there instead of Sakura in the fight against uh, Kaguya, that Kisame would land a crucial blow that would even make Kaguya flinch? Just ser serious question. Do you think that the shark boy here <laughs> is logically, like logically speaking, taking a hit from Juby Madara? And then proceeding to get a cut on Kaguya. Like, be fucking for real right now, y'all. Like, like, be fucking for real, bro. Be fucking for real. So, no, I think I think this is an order, but this is a decent fight. This is a decent fight. It's it's not low diff. Low diff is dick suck now. Now, this, this is two clauses. DMS Kakashi, there's no debate. <laughs> DMS Kakashi, there's no debate. But to be honest, even then, I think this is just where no, you're not beating you're not beating Sasuke. Even if we limit it to just two per, I I genuinely argue Sasuke takes care of these two. Kakashi take care of these two. Yeah, this is just over. That's just cook. That's just cook. I I, I would legit argue. Yeah, so Sasuke and Kiba handle that, and then Kakashi and Hinata handle that, and it's just over. 
I, I think even Warwick Kakashi handles these two rather fondly. So that's 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 grits. Now here's my fucking problem. <laughs> Again, are we doing shove a controller in his ass? I am Naruto. Or are we doing like characters in mind and all of that? Because if we're doing shove controller in his ass, oh, y'all are not going to like how these niggas just win again. Because I'm going to tell you now, this nigga just clones himself and he just fights everybody. <laughs> the nigga Naruto clones himself. He just fights everybody. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Like that's hell. That is hell, bro. <laughs> Naruto clones himself. To be specific, Naruto clones himself, taps everybody on their shoulder. Instead of like the three times boost, probably like a 40 times boost, because it's only three niggas. 1010 would just throw a knife and it would it would just murder this nigga before he even knows what happened. Shikamaru now has the range of Omni Lord. And it just it, it yeah it would be it, yeah sasuke doesn't wipe the no what no don't not to not, look, look, look. i'm not gonna sleep on sasuke sasuke and naruto literally stalemated granted um a little bit nerfed but there was even a point in time where sasuke surpassed and now this is where i would say i'm not gonna sleep on sasuke is the type of nigga where he could make not indra's arrow because it's not enough chakra between these um remaining people but if sasuke really 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 wanted to take naruto down like he just had that character arc moment sasuke absorbs literally every one of these niggas chakra shoots naruto and then they still made again so that's why i'm like for the most part, but I don't think he'd get enough chakra from them. I think it would just be a significantly weaker injure zero. So at that fucking point, I can't say Super 1010, Super Shikamaru, and Super Asuma. Granted, Kakashi probably beats this nigga's ass anyway. But that's what I'm saying. I don't think Sasuke is boom, clone disappearing these clones. I think I think it would be a substantial amount of time, long enough for numbers game. I think yeah, I think it's an annoying way, but for the most part, if it was one on one fights, obviously. If it's if it's one on one fights, this is the order. If it's one on one fights, this is the order, except you probably go here. If it's just anything goes four v four v four v four battle royale, but it's like team versus team, then this is my order. Now there's one other caveat we haven't done. If everybody's on the field at the same fucking time, no cap, these niggas win. If everybody's on the field at the same time, these niggas win. Easy. Because, again, Sasuke just absorbs everyone on the fucking field. And at that point, him and Kakashi can take Naruto at that point. I say that. Especially if we're doing the DMS Kakashi thing. Oh, yeah, GG's. So at that point, yeah. At that, like, Sasuke is made for group environments. Sasuke is literally made to... He like he's like that's actually what happened in the series. It's implied so he would he would put everybody in Chewbacca Tensei, absorb all of these motherfuckers, and at that point Naruto has to one v four DMS Kakashi, um fucking super ultra lord Sasuke. He not to with chakra points at any point. Well, granted these two niggas are relevant, so it's these two. Nah, Naruto clears not DMS, not DM, not DMS Kakashi and Sasuke. Mm-mm. Not DMS Kakashi and Ren Sasuke. No shot. You could argue DMS Kakashi just wins any fucking way. But let alone if DMS Kakashi and. That's way too much. That's way too much. That's way too much. Mm -mm. Naruto definitely don't win that. Naruto definitely. That's why I wasn't doing DMS at first. If I was doing DMS at first, they probably win anyway. Because they just 2v2. But nah. If I add DMS, anything goes. Fatal 4. Yeah. Again, Sasuke absorbs everybody that Kakashi doesn't fight. And Kakashi and Naruto would box damn near evenly. If not, Kakashi would win. And then even if you would say Naruto would be winning, he wouldn't win the second Sasuke pulled up. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. That's grit. That's grit. That's grit. Yeah. At that, at that point, Team Kakashi wins. Then it's Team Asuma. Then I would be Team Karunai. Being said, pretty distant gap now. If y'all are still on this in a battle royale, oh, you lost your mind. Pretty, pretty distant. 
so team Sagara's team is team guy's team kind of just is just like here for moral support in a fatal they got to take away eight uh 12 other motherfuckers hell no <laughs> these niggas are made for one-on-one -on -one combat and shino <laughs> you take out shino these niggas are literally taking out three other people peak and that's it and we're talking peak power team kakashi yeah peak power team kakashi all day Peak power team Kakashi all day. It, it, like, yeah, you got DMS who's arguably stronger than these niggas anyway. If you want to say they're not, they're even. So, best case, Naruto's slightly better than both of them. But, come on. Like, Kakashi would diff these niggas. Um, Shikamaru and Hinata. I'd say he not, I would say Shikamaru's a little bit stronger. But then, like, Kiba and Tenten, who cares? So, at that point, you just... Two's better than one, bro. <laughs> Two is better than one, bro, at that fucking point. Who is blowing my phone up? Oh, I'm getting notifications on Instagram or something. Did you make one video on Spectacular Spider-Man? I bended that. I bended. That video blew up again. Why did it do that? Ten ten. Oh, you're right. Six path weapons, Kiba's packed. You're right. I forgot. Six path weapons, Kiba is packed. You're right. Uh, that's actually a mistake. That's actually a mistake. Yeah, yeah. Six path weapons. Granted, I would still say the team's stronger because she ain't catching these niggas if her life depended on it. But six path weapons, yeah, nah. Kiba's in a fucking pack. <laughs> Kiba's in a fucking pack. That's not even funny. Ten Tenson picked that bitch up in like five seconds, learned how to use it. No, it's over. It's over. But that's why she's on Asuma's team, though. Because, yeah, if she can do that and then add some wind stop, whoo, nigga. The only other argument is if you wanted to put Tenten on Kakashi's team so she can learn more elements. But I think at that point, Kiba just need to learn some elemental. Maybe if he can have, like, a fire fang over fang, some shit. And then, obviously, Kakashi would be a good coach with the two eye talents. Granted, he doesn't know how to be Aquagon works exactly, but no mentor would, so... And then yeah, if I'm doing DMS, they just win. Yeah, this is probably this is probably the Shippuden ranking. Regardless, I think this is the safer thing to do. Cause again, niggas don't know ball about DMS Kakashi. Niggas don't know ball about Sakura. Otherwise, I think this is pretty concrete as well. Even though Naruto at any given point in time, again, you stick a controller in Naruto's ass, Naruto might just solo the whole verse. <laughs> but yeah, Shadow Possession with weapons would be cool. I'm saying, I'm saying. But either way, I definitely like these restructured teams. I feel like we did that chat. I like I like those restructured teams for sure. For sure. We just had a wee moment, chat. We got nerdy.